The Youth Criminal Justice Act is the law that governs Canada's youth justice system. It applies to youth who are at least 12 but under 18 years old, who are alleged to have committed criminal offences. On April 1, 2003, the Youth Criminal Justice Act came into force, completely replacing previous legislation. This act introduced significant reforms to address concerns about how the youth justice system had evolved. These concerns included the overuse of courts and incarceration in less serious cases, disparity and unfairness in sentencing, a lack of effective reintegration of young people released from custody, and the need to better take into account the interests of the victims. The Youth Criminal Justice Act provided the legislative framework for a fairer and more effective youth justice system. The amendments adopted by Parliament in 2012 aim to strengthen the ways in which the youth justice system deals with repeat and violent offenders. The age of the person governs the degree of criminal re responsibility. Eleven years and younger, the person is classified as a child and bears no criminal responsibility. Between 12 and 17 years of age, the person is classified as a youth and bears partial criminal responsibilities. 18 years and older, the person is tried as an adult. The youth criminal justice system is intended to protect the public by holding the young people accountable through measures that are proportionate to the seriousness of the offense and the degree of responsibility of the young person. It is to promote the rehabilitation and reintegration of young per persons and to support crime prevention by referring young persons to programs or agencies in the community to address circumstances underlying their offending behavior. In keeping with the Act's objectives, charging has decreased significantly and police diversion of cases through extrajudicial measures has increased significantly. Young persons who were not charged include use diverted from the court process through the use of warnings, referrals to community programs, cautions, and pre-charge extrajudicial sanctions.